Hello, it is Saturday. It is Saturday, May the 18th. This is the Green Bar Valley Church of the Nazarene with your daily devotion for today. Today, your devotion comes from the New Testament book of Philippians, Paul's letter to the church in Philippi. We will be reading from chapter 4, verses 13 through 23. Here's the word of the Lord. I can do all this through him who gives me strength. Yet it was good of you to share in my troubles. Moreover, as you Philippians know, in the early days of your acquaintance with the gospel, when I set out from Macedonia, not one church shared with me in the matter of giving and receiving, except you only. For even when I was in Thessalonica, you sent me aid more than once when I was in need. Not that I desire your gifts. What I desire is that more be credited to your account. I have received full payment and have more than enough. I am amply supplied now that I have received from Aphrodite the gift you sent. They are a fragrant offering, an acceptable sacrifice, pleasing to God. And my God will meet all your needs according to the riches of his glory in Christ Jesus. To our God and Father be glory forever and ever. Amen. Greet all God's people in Christ Jesus. The brothers and sisters who are with me send greetings. All God's people here send you greetings, especially those who belong to Caesar's household. The grace of the Lord Jesus Christ be with your spirit. Amen. That is the word of the Lord. The article today is titled, God Provides, written by Ryan Quanstrom. Here's what Ryan writes for us today. Context matters a lot. Paul says that he can do all this through him who gives me strength. Some read this to mean that Paul can do all things. What he really means is, I have learned the secret of being content in any and every situation whether well-fed or hungry, whether living in plenty or in work. That comes from verse 12. He was telling the Philippians that God had provided for him through the generosity of the Philippians. Paul was in prison when he wrote this letter. He needed the church this to supply his needs. And the church did exactly that. They gave Paul the power to praise and encourage the Philippians. God had provided for Paul, thus the Philippians had no need to worry if they also found themselves in times of deep trouble. God would provide for all their needs as well. Many testify to this in our churches. God meets our needs, perhaps not how we expect nor how we want. Nevertheless, God provides for God's people, typically through the local congregation. Be Still, My Soul, by Katrina von Schegel. Leave to thy God to order and provide, and every charge he faithful will remain. And as we have just read in Philippians chapter 4, but verse 6, Do not be anxious about anything, but in every situation, by prayer and petition, with thanksgiving, present your requests to God. And this is your daily devotion for Saturday, May the 18th. We are the Green Bar Valley Church of the Nazarene, and we hope that you have a very blessed day.